Throughout her astronomical rise in the world of cycling, 23-year-old Tenille Campbell has managed to remain grounded. But in a recent conversation I had with her from her base in Italy, I attribute her humility to the fact that what we are witnessing is new to us, but already well documented by the rider herself. Nothing can stop the man with the right mental attitude from achieving your goal. Tenille Campbell's cycling career is an embodiment of her favorite quote from Thomas Jefferson. In under three years honing her craft in Europe, first with the UCI World Team and then with Pro Unit Valka Travel Services, she has become the first woman from the English speaking Caribbean to qualify for the Olympic Games. Now she's also secured her dream professional contract with Mitchelton Scott. Bewildering to you and I as it may be, Campbell says she visualized and vocalized this a long time ago. <laughs> I can't tell you how much times I told my friends, yeah, I'm going to the Olympics. Watch, you're going to see. <laughs> I mean, you can call them and ask them, they will tell you. I think even in secondary school, I wrote so much about myself in cycling. I mean, stories that it didn't even happen, but yeah, I was creating it in my head and it ended up happening. Yet, somehow, through all of this, she's incredibly rooted. And instead of reveling in these accomplishments, she says she's already narrowed her vision toward the next thing, whatever it might be, continuing to chase the real high. I watch how everyone reacts to it, <laughs> especially my family. And it's really a push factor to me to keep, to keep going. And especially one of my goals being the fact that I, I want to help stimulate the growth and development of cycling in Trinidad and Tobago and also in the Caribbean. Here comes uh, Tenielle Campbell. I'm really excited about the rider here in the pink for uh, Valcar. She says uh, she says in some interviews as well, she, she feels she wants to be the Usain Bolt of, uh, of women women's cycling. When people think of the Caribbean, they automatic, automatically think Usain Bolt and Jamaica. Nothing else. Like, that's the first thing that comes in their heads. I was like... Okay, when people start, when people think of the Caribbean, they should think about Tim Campbell and Trinidad and Tobago. <laughs> so, you know, Usain Bolt is a phenomenal athlete, and it's not because of the accomplishments alone that he, he has, but it's because of the person he is outside of the sport. Proven to be talented beyond expectation and mature beyond her years, there's no telling how far Tadil Campbell's own will, imagination, and two wheels will take her. Certainly one of the success stories in sport for this year and, of course, uh, the end of 2019.